Hey guys, Fuller D here. <clears throat> We're back for more Fire Emblem Path of Radiance. And remember when I said bring Volk with you? Uh, no, don't do that. If your Volk is level 3 or lower, or is like not a high level, don't bring his ass. Don't bring his ass, especially if you didn't train him. If you have chest keys, you will have enough to, you know, do shit by yourself without him. So yes, this chapter. This chapter has three thieves. You want to kill these thieves fast. If you plan out your first turn, you can easily do that. I was just bringing two healers with you. Uh, one to follow the group to going to the left, and one to follow the group going to the right. If you do that, you'll have very good reassurance of n people not getting their ass kicked. Uh, never but nevertheless, this chapter is very fun. I love this chapter. It's pretty much uh, shows off how beastly Ike has gotten. For one thing, I will send just Ike to the north. You will see him kick a lot of ass if you do that. I mean, Ike is pretty much to the point where he can solo these chapters. He's to the point where he can solo most things right now. He's pretty much beastly in every way. Uh, let's see. Uh, but the, your other army, your, your other units might need a little help. Oscar and these four guys will be going to the west along with Zorin. These uh, these guys are going to the right. Reese, uh, Jill, Oscar, Nephany, and Rolf. I think I want to make sure Rolf has a boat. Yep. And Ike will just be going north because he doesn't really need any help. You will see how Ike just like fucks everything up. So let's get this chapter started because I think I have everything set up. Basically, you just want to make sure that uh, you kill, with your first move, you kill one or two or possibly all of these guys right here. And possibly three guys, two three guys over here. If you can't do that, uh, it's going to be a little bit problematic to getting this thief. Because once you kill this thief and you have like nine movement, or nine to eight movement units over here, they're going to fuck that thief up. So... That's the nice thing about having that planned in mind. So let's get this chapter started. There will be no units to be recruited here. You're pretty much to the point where recruitments are rare and in between and far in between. So chapter begin time. Battle phase. Let's have I kill this guy. Let's show him what he's made of. Sup, buddy? You gonna die for me? Oh, Ether Ike, how dare you! Ether. Oh, there it is. Mm. Oh. Yeah. You get no sympathy Damn from it. me. Good. I did not expect that shit. It's like you should expect everything. This is a general that they're talking about. The general that fucking took over Fort Pinnell, damn it. Alright, and I think we're gonna have Jill come over here and smack your ass. With a silver axe. Ooh. Or a steel axe. And she kills him one go in one battle. Sweet. Alright, Jill. Go at it. Go the fuck at it. <clears throat> Punk. Come on, dodge. Yeah. Dead. Alright. And those are the only... Uh, these knights are the only unpromoted units in this chapter. Everything else is promote city. Uh... Oh, yeah, I guess maybe the freaking, uh... Those silly-looking thieves over there. Why would you... Why would you even consider them units? They're pretty much... They're pretty much nuisances to me. Oh, dodging. Killing you! <clears throat> Holy crap. Did not expect that. Okay, so Nephany just, like, took that shithead out. Sweet. And now we just have this general in the way. Let's see if... Let's see if someone can do something, at least. Rolf, get your ass over here. That sucks, Rolf. You can't... You can't get enough movement in there to get over there. Damn. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to make Rolf's brave bow better again. There you go. Here's a gift. Here's a gift from Santa Claus. It's like, oh no, it's a, re it's a renewed brave bow. Brave bow. It's, all, it's all what I always wanted. Shut up. It, co it cost me fucking one hammer need staff use, dick. And I'm pretty sure Oscar will tear this guy up. <clears throat> Oscar, if you don't next stab, I'll never forgive you. Wait, where did you get the silver lance? God damn it. Well, at least you're fucking him up. And not getting hit. That's even better. So, apparently I mistaked my brave lance for my, uh... Steel lance. I don't know how that worked. <coughs> Kieran, meet 
make this guy meet his end. Do 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 hit do 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 dodge. Yep. Kill you. We're almost come to it. Damn it. So so far so damn good with the whole. I'll just leave you right here, bud. And then uh, Brom can sit right here. Introduce Iron Sword play to this douchebag. If you Luna him, I will be happy. That's not Luna ing. Dodging though. <laughs> Luna, yeah. Kick your ass. <gasps> Two pick. Yeah, good job. Beat his ass. Beat it. I think uh, Marcio hit this guy with a Wu Dao. Hopefully dodge. I mean, 24% is pretty low, but. And Radiant Dawn, that means, oh, there's a good chance, but don't count on it. Mm. And there's those kills for Zahar, sweet. But yeah, that Wu Dao, or the, the... I've been learning some horrible things with percentages and, that, and Radiant Dawn. It's like, holy crap. Uh, and of course Zahar crits like, bro, fuck you. Uh, for one thing, the percentages in Radiant Dawn seem to be like, uh... Oh, 20%, yeah, yeah, you'll, you'll think you dodge that, no. I've had per I've had a lot of 20% hits my character in that game. This game, 20% seems more 20%-ish. But then again, I don't know how percentages work in that game, or either game, all that well. I mean, I'm pretty sure there's a place where you can look them up. Serenity Force. But <coughs> nevertheless... Oscar gets beat by a steel or tomahawk. Damn it! Oh no! And looks like this cat wants to play with Ike. Too bad Ike's not in a playful mood today. Oh, you dick! Ike, teach this cat a lesson. That's not teaching him a lesson, damn it! I want him to be a dead cat. I want him to be so dead that he would that uh, even hell won't recognize him. Oh, dead! Well, that was a dumb general. Too bad. He could have freaking sold his ass, though, Oscar. Just saying. Alright, so that takes care of him. And, of course, Marcia is taking a little bit of heat. And this guy was really thinking he was going to hit her. Nope. And you're dead for that mistake. Alright, good job, Marcia. Way to, way to make guys with axes feel like idiots. And they all want to play with her. It's like, <laughs> Pretty looking lady. Might need some help with this accent. It's like, yeah, let me help you, my sore bitch. Dead. And Marcia gladly kills another guy. Oh, I see the game. God, does everyone attack Marcia today? Fuck. And she dodges. So that's the reason why I sent Marcia to West. Since she has a full guard, she will do just fine against those assholes with the bows. I can castrate this cat for the love of Christ. Mm. No, you're just leaving him alive. What, you want them to get euthanize themselves in fear? It's like, oh no, aren't you? Oh, Brom's got a, got a friend. Brom, kick his ass. <laughs> Ow. Brom, if you double Luna, I will be happy. That's not double Luna-ing. That's only single Luna-ing. Damn, you didn't even do single Luna. Fuck. Oh well. Okay, looks like we got these assholes. Hmm, I think I'm gonna have Nephany kill this guy real fast. Steel Lance is fine, and wow, one damage? You are not a threatening like, longsword guy. Yeah, you're dead. So, as you can see, Nephany is really showing off her colors of skill. I mean, she's just messing everything up, girl. And I think I'm gonna have Rolf and Brees double team this guy. Or it could just be Rolf doing all the work because I saw that that four, that 32 crit. And he doesn't, he's decides to leave him alive. Cool, girl. Way to go, don't. Since Oscar can possibly soul this guy for HP. Come on, Oscar, soul him. He doesn't deserve any mercy. Damn it, Oscar. Mercy, damn it. No mercy. No mercy. Oh, Oscar kills that shameless thief. Do, 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 and you're dead. <clears throat> Starting to see Jill's skill really start to kick in and fail on her. 
I mean, she, her accuracy with the Steel Lance is kind of bleh. But I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining too much. Do 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 do. One thing she has better defense than Oscar. Do, 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 do. Jeez, someone like hacking up a lung downstairs. Dead. <clears throat> do, 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 And that's the guy's done. And no reach level up, damn. Up staff. Wait, what? Okay, can I can I be explained that? How does using a magic book level up your staff? I'm not gonna complain, because that was actually good. Okay, now to sort this mess over here. Carrying kill things. Make this thief pay for being a or leading a life of of thievery and dishonor. <clears throat> Alright, good job, Kieran. Kirinator slays another victim. And a double bow is obtained. Speaking of the double bow, it's a unique bow made by a master craftsman. It's powerful but difficult to wield. The problem with the killer bow or the double bow is that it has a range of four only. It's not two to four. If it was two to four, this bow would be kind of really fucking good. But in this case, this bow is kind of weird. Um, it, they did change that in the second game where they made the killer bow the bow had the range of 1 to 2, which made, and it was really powerful, so it was a really good bow. In this game, it's more like a doubled-edged sword, because that means people with a normal bow can kick your ass and you can't retaliate, which kind of sucks. <clears throat> but nevertheless, that is the... That's that weapon. We're going to put it in the convoy, because we don't need it. <clears throat> I doubt that anyone besides Rolf can use it at this point. Even then, I think Rolf might have problems. <coughs> I think I'll have uh, Zorin fry this cat. Because he can. And Zorin destroys something. Yeah, fuck yeah. Good job, Zorin. Way to make another cat on the list of fried pets. <coughs> do, do, do. And then I would just put Brom right here. Marcia can almost follow, but damn. <clears throat> Zahark, if you don't kill this guy, I'll be pissed. I mean, you and your, your depth crits? Yeah, see? <clears throat> Zahark never lets me down. He'll either depth or crit, and he crit today. He might even do... He, and he has done both, too, so it's like, oh. What do you want, Wander? Button? Both? Or the... Etc, etc. <clears throat> <clears throat> so as you can see, this pretty much this team is pretty much just handing these guys their asses right now, and Ike is still having trouble killing kitties. Not that it's a bad thing, because I mean he gets more experience killing kitties in this fashion. Let's see if Ike gets nothing. Damn. Whoop! That ends my turn, and now Ike's gonna get attacked by bolting. Please dodge it. Thank you. And I'm pretty sure these cats are going to convene on his ass, but I, what you could do to make me happy is to ether this cat. No prostration? Damn. Too bad, Ike. Oh well, we got another cat that wants to play too. Pet me, pet me, pet me, pet me, meow. It's like, no. Go. Yep, damn it. <laughs> yes, castration. <laughs> Fuck you. Either. Oh. Too bad. That's what you get for getting an Ike's way, damn it. I think these guys might. Oh, Brom is getting a customer. I wonder if Brom is gonna Luna his ass. Wow, that's a fun trick. <laughs> wow. I feel bad for that Swordsmaster. He is just so ineptly done. So ineptly done. I mean, I mean, there's nothing he can do at that raise. Like, oh, uh, crap. Brom is like, yeah, I'm so not interested in you that I'm just gonna walk past you. We've got more things to do. Not play with this little fool. Okay, who needs the experience for? Marcia, since you're about to level up, let's have Kieran kill this guy. <clears throat> 
He has a 100% chance of doing it. And his blood needs to run red some more. Fuck yes. Good job, Karen. Manly red armor, manly red sword. Just ass kicking all down. So, Karen does more fun things. And get a door key. So, I'm gonna put him right here so he can do some door opening late next turn. <clears throat> so, Hart, get your ass up here. Marcia, do get up here. And hopefully Zorin can play this thing called catch up because he's his six movement is really biting on his ass. Not fun. Okay, you. I think Jill, since Jill's closer, let's have Jill attack. Ow with the brave sword action. Fuck. Okay, new plan. Okay, new plan times two. Wait and lure this guy closer first. Okay, then I'll just like pounce on with all three of my guys. The first healing. There you go. So basically, this is a nice little, uh, a nice little met or er, symbolism right here. Os Kieran's leading one team, and Oscar's leading another. Right now, Kieran's team is leading. Oh crap! I feel bad for him. I think I'll just have Ike fuck this guy up. So Karen's team is already at the door and Oscar's team's trying to figure out how to take care of that douchebag. Mm. And fuck. Oh, no level up Ike. Fine. Alright, let's put Jill in range. She can take it. Do 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 Ah damn it, you're gonna really attack Karen. Nope, you failed. Good job, Kieran. Way to dodge like a pro. And Jill will now take the Brave Sword upside the face and dodges twice. Good hop. My goodness, that thing is on. I guess that Ryvern is on Bunny Hop's pill. Jeez. And Ike is probably going to not get hit. Ow. I should have figured. Damn it, Ike. You couldn't get us Ether in those two hits. Jeez. <clears throat> Oh, nice try, Ike. Ike, and Ike levels up. Let's see what he gets. HP, damn it. Thank you. Magic. Oh, he got spiel, skill and speed. And he got 10 magic now. Wow. Moon sword for you later, Ike. Alright, so Ike did shit. Now Ike's gonna move to the left. And this guy is probably going to get shot by somebody. Hmm. Who needs the experience more? Oh, in this case, it looks like it's good old Oscar to the rescue. <clears throat> Bow upside the face. Bow upside side the face. <clears throat> and Oscar kills things. Fuck yes. Alright, so, so far we got pretty much both sides cleared out, and I'm gonna move Oscar... Wait, where, who has a key? Who has a fucking key? Uh, you don't. Who does? You do. You trade. So I'm gonna trade, give Oscar the key so we can then march our asses in here. Do do. Okay, who needs healing? You do, Nephany, even though it's like 1 HP. Whoop de doo, that's good. That's scary. <clears throat> Alright, so Reese does some more healing. I think I'm going to try to do this thing called make the adventure all better again and. Now we will be charging in this room after we get Brom all healed up, because I need good I need star stunning Brom here. Hmm. Okay, let's do this. I'm gonna prepare just to give him a hammer, because there is a big fearsome force in this next room. Uh I don't I would suggest running in here without some preparations here. Like give her i I'm gonna give her a steel lance. And then I think the chaplain will be a good weapon to you, from. So don't break the damn thing now. Okay, that should end my turn. Let's see what happens. Wow, he really does not like Kieran today. Dodging. Good job, Kieran. Making me proud. And this guy's gonna try to fuck with Ike. God, man, these guys with their silver lances scaring the shit out of me with them. E, Ike, what are you doing? Prepare Thank yourself. you, Ether, his ass. Yeah, fuck yeah. No, and Ike, Ether's another defenseless, well, I guess, a 
dick hole soul with his own weapon of choice.